This tutorial is about the Google Classroom app. Um, all students and staff in WCPS have the Google Classroom app available to you in self-service if it's not already on your iPad. Um, the Google Classroom app works closely with Drive, Docs, and Slides as well, so you want to make sure that you have those um, apps installed. So my Google Classroom app is right here in my dock bar. So whenever I pull it up, it looks very much like the um, the website version from your MacBook. Um, essentially, as soon as you as soon as it loads, it's going to show you your entire list of classes, those that you um, are the teacher of, and also those that you belong to as a student. Um, just like you do in the website, you can choose the classroom that you want to go into. Um, I'm going to choose fourth grade ELA for this. Uh, so it comes up with your stream where your announcements are. It shows you all the people who are in the classroom. Um, and then for the newer ones, the newer classes, um, it's going to show you your classwork area as well. Just like with the website, you click on the assignments, you'll be able to see all the student work, you can insert the grades. Um, one thing to note is when you click on a document, it does open it in Google Docs. It opens it like this, and then from here, this is where you can click the pencil and um, manipulate it, kind of like you would um, the markup feature. Um, in your photos or um, you can click the little um, box in the top right corner with the arrow and that will open it in Google Docs for editing. Okay, so back in the classroom um, you let me pull up a question from a different class So you can see all the, the way that things look here is very much the same as um, it does whenever you do it on the website. Um, the students see things very similarly too. Here's the question. Um, so you can see each of the student answers, the question, the student work, all listed here for you, and you can also insert the grades. Um, to see what it's like when you're a student in a class, um, I'm going to go to the students will see a view very similar to what they also see on the website and they can access all of their documents and information um, the same way so basically anything that you can do on the website you can do here it's very similar um, it, under your classes, if you hit the plus in the corner, you can actually even create a class or have your students join a class from the app. So Google has done a great job of mimicking the website on the app and really giving you all the functionality that you, that you would need.